Every digital program will have its problems and challenges. There's no doubt about it. What an organization needs to do is develop a culture of innovation, develop a culture of what's referred to quite often as fast failure, learning from that, celebrating actually the things that don't do well, learn from those and apply those in practice. Hi, I'm Greg Unsworth. I'm the digital business leader for PwC Singapore. And in my role, me and my teams are involved in helping our clients with their most pressing needs as they undertake their digital journey. I'm also responsible for our overall transformation as a firm. You're watching Let's Get Real, and today we'll be talking about digital transformation. When we look at leading organizations who've actually progressed really well on their digital journeys, there's a few common elements that we see. One really important point is about communication. Leading from the top, setting the tone, communicating and getting everyone, whether it's the board, business leaders and all employees on board. Number two, it's about investing in broad-based upskilling. There is so much to do with any organization and to do that at scale that just doing it within siloed digital business units won't be successful. You really need the whole organization to move up the learning curve and actually develop the broad-based skill set whilst also tapping into the deep specialists that any organization had. The final part I'd say is around measuring success and measuring results and not being afraid to make changes when things aren't working out well and coming up with new priorities for the organization to moving ahead. One of the things that's really important in any digital transformation program is building in what we refer to as digital trust. It's dealing with the risks of going digital and by doing that at the outset, it enables organizations to move faster and with more confidence. For example, making sure there's the right responses and a robust cybersecurity strategy to deal with the use of new technologies, and also especially an expanded online presence. Importantly, data protection is really important. Data security, particularly confidential data, needs to be kept secure. And then finally, it's also for organizations to comply with new and evolving regulations that we're seeing evolve in this new digital economy. Important thing to realize is going digital is about more than the technology. In fact, it really should start with the business vision and then looking how digital programs can support that vision. Well, thank you so much for listening. I do hope you found this helpful and insightful and gave you something to think about in, as you reimagine digital for your organization.